everyone, welcome to Hedgehog Hollow. I'm Alexandra. And I'm Hannah. And we are here to launch to you Inktoberfest. Inktoberfest is gonna be a month long event throughout the whole of October. Every day we have either us or guest designers coming to the Hedgehog Hollow blog and they'll be explaining a different type of ink. Now there are so many paper crafting inks on the market. On the table we have a small amount of some of the different pens and inks and ink pads and sprays and all those fun things that we get to play with, but we don't necessarily know what each one does. And we could sit here for an entire year and do a video every day, but what we thought is we will take every October to be Inktoberfest, and it'll be a festival of ink education, and we hope that it's inspiring. So let's take a look of what's on the table, and uh, let's have a look at some of the different things you can get. We are gonna start off our Inktoberfest talking about some of the specialty inks by Tim Holtz. He has distress pads, um, distress oxides, re-inkers. We have alcohol inks in here. There is so much education that we need to talk about. Every single product will get a different day in Inktoberfest. Yeah, and distress has so many different things. You can see here there are sprays and there's glazes, and I think so many of us don't know what we want to do. There are distress markers. markers. Right. There are so many things to do. So we are going to take a day for each of the different types, and we've got some top tips from when we saw Tim in Stampaway that right. we're also going to share with you. We're going to do a day all about different black inks. I mean, this right. is a small selection of the black inks I have in that black ink. There's so My top many drop. black inks. Right. What one do you use? When do you use it? Why would you use it? We're going to talk about specialty pads, something like an ombre pad. We're going to talk about creating your own ink pads. Uh, we've got foiling. How do you foil with inks? Right. You I didn't know you could do it until recently. Right. So you can use glue as an ink. Right. We're going to talk to you about that. We're going to talk to you about some of the pens that are available, different markers, alcohol markers, brush lettering. Monteverde have given us some amazing inks and fountain pens. We're going to show you those. We've got a huge collection of pens in our thing up here. We've got alcohol markers, brush script markers, um, Marvie La Plume, Spectra Noirs. This is so many different so pens. So many products. Right. And what do you use when? We're also going to focus on the things that you can use on black cardstock right. because not every ink works on black cardstocks and some are much better than others. We've got Catherine Pula is going to do a video for you all about her ink. She's doing that herself. We can't wait to get her tips. We're going to talk about pigment inks and some of the properties. Hybrid inks, what's the difference between that and a dye ink? Uh, Criola have given us some amazing products to show you as well as part of their signature and take no paper crafting range. What's the difference between an ink cube and a regular ink pad? Right. Fade out inks for no line coloring, hybrid inks, archival inks. Wendy Vecchi has just come out with a range of blendable inks. Are they different to distress inks? Let's find out. Right. So there is just so many different things. We've got embossing powders here and embossing pads and heat and bond powders. Ultra thick embossing powders, liquid watercolors, sprays, mica mist, liquid watercolors in pens. So many different things. Right, there's so much. It's Absolutely. mind boggling. Right, and most paper crafters don't know where to start. Yep. We're lucky we have quite a big selection of everything. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna share those tips and tricks and our favorites with you. So we are totally excited to show you all these amazing products. This is just really a small selection of all the different inks out there and we could go on for many months, but we hope to be back every Inktoberfest to share more ideas with you. We will have myself and Hannah doing videos with you. We've got our design team and we have amazing guest designers, including Shauna Klingerman, Catherine Pula, Rita Barakat, and so many more coming along. Wendy Vecchi is going to be yes. telling us all about her inks as well. So lots and lots of ideas and inspiration for you. We hope you'll join us every day. You'll want to be checking out the Hedgehog Hollow blog every day where everyone is posting. Plus we have some specials for you. Tonic every single day in October is going to be providing a specific discount code for that day. You're not going to want to miss that. Additionally, many of the companies that are participating are offering giveaways and other coupon codes. All of that information is going to be in the blog post, so definitely don't skip out on this incredible experience. Absolutely. So lots of inspiration, give giveaways, goodies, coupon codes. I mean, what more could you really right. want? Plus you'll be creating your tag book. Yes. And then also we'll be having little bits in between on Instagram. We'll be having the Tonic Facebook Lives are going to be all about Inktoberfest as well. So lots and lots to join us for. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button yep. and ring the bell so that you hear every time we have a new video up. And we'd love for you to give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and you're also excited for Inktoberfest. Happy stamping everyone. See you soon. Soon. Bye. Bye.